गौतम बुद्ध बिगेन लाइफ एज ए प्रिंस नेम्ड सिद्धार्थ गौतम इन नॉर्थर्न इंडिया एट ट्वेल्व ही वॉज सेंट अवे फॉर स्कूलिंग इन द हिंदू सेक्रेट स्क्रिप्चर्स एंड फोर ईयर्स लेटर ही रिटर्न होम टू मैरी ए प्रिंसेज दे हैड ए सन एंड लिव्ड फॉर टेन ईयर्स एज बिफिटेड रॉयल्टी एट अबाउट द एज ऑफ ट्वेंटी फाइव द प्रिंस हियर टू फोर सिल्डेड फ्रॉम द सफरिंग ऑफ द वर्ल्ड वाइल आउट हंटिंग चांस्ड अपान ए सीख मैन देन एन एज्ड मैन देन ए फ्यूनरल प्रोसेसन एंड फाइनली ए मंग बेगिंग फॉर आल्स दिस साइट सो मूवड हिम दैट ही एट वंस वेंट आउट इन टू द वर्ल्ड टू सीक इनलाइटमेंट कंसर्निंग द सारोज he had witnessed he wandered from se- for seven years and finally sat down under a peepal tree where he vowed to stay until enlightenment came enlightened after seven days he re- renamed the tree the bodhi tree tree of wisdom and began to teach and to share his new understandings at that point he became known as the buddha it means the awakened or the enlightened the buddha preached his first sermon at the city of banaras most holy of the dipping places on the river ganga that sermon has been preserved and that sermon is given here it reflects the buddha's wisdom about one inscrutable kind of suffering let's start explanation of these lines gautam buddh was a prince His name was Siddhartha. When he was twelve years old, he was sent away for studying Hindu holy books. After four years, he returned. Means he came back home to marry a princess. he and his wife lived in royal manner for 10 years they had a son also gautam buddh was shielded from the suffering of the world before he was 25 years old means he was completely unknown from the sufferings or sorrows of the world but suddenly one day when he had gone out for hunting he saw a sick man then an old man and a funeral parrot and finally a monk who was begging alms these sights means the sight of old man funeral procession sick man these sights influenced gautam buddh too much so at once he became a beggar he moved in the world in the search of enlightenment enlightenment means knowledge he wandered in the world for 7 years and finally he sat down under a tree it was a peepal tree or fig tree 
he bowed he took an oath he pledged that he would stay under that tree until he got enlightenment after 7 days he got enlightened he renamed that tree the bow tree or bodhi tree it means the tree of wisdom after getting knowledge or enlightenment he started to share his knowledge and understanding to the people he started to teach the people then he became famous as the buddh the word buddh means the awakened or the enlightened ज्ञान प्राप्त किया हुआ व्यक्ति या जागृत व्यक्ति ही डिलीवर्ड हिज फर्स्ट सरमन एट बनारस बनारस इज ए सिटी एंड ए हॉली प्लेस दैट इज लोकेटेड ऑन द बैंक ऑफ द रिवर द हॉली रिवर गंगा हिज फर्स्ट सरमन has been preserved and that has been printed here in in this book this sermon reflects the knowledge of buddh about suffering and sorrow that is very mysterious for the people of the world so it was the brief explanation of these lines that i have read thank you have a nice day